don't know. <laughs> like maybe we maybe we should have picked uh, the baby mode or whatever. <clears throat> Hello. Howdy, everyone. Um, that's not where we're actually at right now. <laughs> I meant to, you know, like preload the game so that it'd be ready whenever we got started. And uh, I did so, but I loaded the wrong save file. And, oh god, I meant, I thought whenever I would hit start select, you know, R1, L1, do the soft reset, I thought that would let us pick the game to load, but it didn't. Um, so, hold on, I'm just going to hit the reset button on the PS2 real quick. Stuff. I, I assume we should grab the money though. Do we need the money for anything other than playing like more mini games? Like, do you have to collect all the mini games and shit to to win, or is it just optional shit? I have no clue, man. And so far, the only thing the coins do is let us get them back up here, right? I think we just missed a battery, which I'm assuming is important for us to get. For one reason or another. Get ready for race two, hey, thank you so much for the five bits. Okay, so uh, no, you can you can soft reset with like start select R one L one. Some games it's a little bit different of a uh, combination, right? It just it's game dependent. But anyways, in in most games, I'm used to it taking you like clear back to the uh, title screen like all the way back to the beginning right so like to here so that i could load a new save but that's not how it works in this game this game it apparently just takes you back to the home really it never worked for you it just depends on the game like most uh final fantasy games have it in there a lot of a lot of uh japanese titles just in general seem to have that feature like this one for instance like i said i can do start select r1 l1 while in the main game and it brings us back to here, I guess. I Like I said, I was hoping it would take us back to the very beginning. Uh, but anyways, okay. Off camera, I did spend a little bit of time grinding. And uh, so hopefully we have everything we need to make this pretty quick. Fingers crossed. I hope that I remember all the stuff from the, uh, from the prophecy from last week. Because... It has, you know, it's been a week. My memory is not very good, but I'm I'm sure it'll be fine. We only have three characters to pick, and we know the first one that we need to pick, or, or technically the third one. Anyways, uh, and then, hey, Valkyrie, actually, I was just getting ready to mention you. Um, and then, thanks to Valkyrie, actually, I he, or they, sent me a uh, really neat video on like the strat they used to to defeat the boss that we got stuck on last time sadly i didn't have time to get around to watching it until today which didn't leave me enough time to to grind out stuff for their strategy i think i did get some napalm which is like the the bread and butter of your strategy right valkyrie um so i think i have some of that but i don't i don't know if it's enough but we'll see at the very least i did go through the all three characters that we have left here gwen uh mercedes and and uh velvet and and grinded out a little bit of of stuff for them so fingers crossed we should be okay i think we got this i think i think we're gonna be good man oh buddy here we go i'm gonna watch the cutscene since it has been a week Yeah, I figured I figured we could start the stream off with a nice bit of depression, you know, just <laughs> Fuck me Hey, 
どのこの修練が予言通りなら勝利者はお前ではない予言通り<笑>確かに予言のままだここまでだが我らを押しとどめ滅ぼすという世界樹とやらはどこだねそんなものありはしない焼けた大地を見ようどれがその木だか知らんすでに森ごと燃え尽きた動けた魔法使いとこの栗ごとだ間違うこともあるだろう今この世界は炎のみなされ大地が出来上がった時の姿に戻る Here we go, dude. Dude's gonna get wrecked this time. <laughs> Alright, I don't remember exactly what all I、uh, grind, ground out, like what all I collected off camera. It should be enough, fingers crossed. <laughs> At the very least, hey, we have some experience. We kind of know how to dodge now. Yeah, just remember the timing of the dodges, etc. Like, I think the doges. Uh, I, think, I think we're going to be okay. Plus, plus, we have some equipment that we didn't have last time. So that'll be, you know, very helpful.、Um, okay, so I actually. <laughs> okay, I, don't rem <laughs> I don't remember having this many napalms.、Um, apparently, actually, we're fine.、Uh... <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. I also collected a couple ancient crystals with people.、Um, so that if we die, we don't actually die. I did that too. So,、uh, yeah, I think, I think we should be okay, actually. <laughs> Hopefully. Fingers crossed, man.、Uh, okay, so throw down a napalm, which in this version only stacks to, to one. I think in that video you sent me, didn't it stack to like two or something like that?、Uh, foes on burst. And then hopefully you are now in a. Oh, wait, do I have an、uh, unlimited power with, with her? I don't remember if I got one with her or not. There's an antidote, ancient crystal, elixirs. No, no unlimited power, which is annoying, but honestly, like, it, it should be okay. Okay.、Uh, oh, nope, that's. Nope. Go back down. He is. He's frozen right now. Reload. Kick his ass? Yeah, dude. I think, I think we got this.、Um, he's still frozen, I think. So, just keep shooting. Okay, he's unfrozen. Where's the napalm? There we go. Throw down one napalm. Two napalm. I don't know what he's doing right now, but it doesn't look good. The lag begins. Yes, it does.、Uh, foes on burst. Okay, he's frozen again. Just fucking shoot him as much as we can, dude. Okay.、Uh, before he, he does much, Napalm.、Uh, okay, that didn't work.、Uh, foes on burst. Ah,、oh, come on, dude. Come on. <laughs> don't, don't do me like this game. We were so close to getting him killed without him even being able to do anything. But it's fine. We just gotta wait for him to come back. Uh, take a, take a spirit of some sort. Anything so that we don't die now after, after all that. Oh, I mean, I guess actually we still wouldn't die anyways. Because we got the, uh, we got the ancient crystal. Bye, Onyx, yeah. <laughs> Onyx getting fucked, bruh. Alright, we, I think he's, he's probably gonna make his way about back to here. So if we just throw that, I think that'll, yeah, dude. Get fucked, Onyx. <laughs> <laughs> It's amazing how much of a difference having some、uh, items makes, man. <laughs> like, went from、uh, damn near unbeatable at my skill level to just easy.
私はやはりダメなんですねお母様にはなれなかったおー、シェッドゥーン。おー、マン。OK。そしては、the world tree all along。ダメ、you don't even like her。Yeah, right, bro? Like, she's terrible to play, but I'm tearing up a little bit over here. I you can't help but feel bad for her, man. ユンドラシ、世界中のな。世界中に阻まれ、炎は消え去る。予言にあるのはお前だったのかメルセデス愚かだ最後で見誤った Should've just stayed in your fucking volcano, dude マダムの写真やはり予言は耕がえた生き残る者など言えしないこの焦土に不毛の大地に You would have drowned if you did, only if no one else figured out how to stop everything from going on, right? Because him burning everything didn't stop the, the waters from rising, did it? That's not the way I interpreted the, the events, at least. Yeah, we'll save the game, of course. One thing that I, that I was reading that I kind of wish was in this version that's in the, uh, the remastered version. In the remastered version, you can pick up that book and like replay any of the... Other、uh, boss fights at the end, the, the boss gauntlet, whatever the hell you want to call it, so you can see all of the different endings. In this game, the only way to see all the different endings is by just replaying all five of them, which is kind of annoying, but I mean, at least they're, they're relatively short whenever you know you have equipment for everyone. <laughs> Choose a character to fight the cauldron. Okay, so I mean, it's gotta be Velvet, right? That's the only one that could possibly do the cauldron one. Plus, I, I don't remember the prophecy directly, but didn't it say something about like the chains and, and the cauldron and, and some BS like that? So I'm like 99. It's her fate to, to fight the cauldron. <laughs> fate in caps because Velvet's story is called Fate or whatever. I get your hint, but I, I'm pretty sure it's, it's Velvet, anyways, right? It, like, again, it's Velvet's like directly connected to the cauldron, has been throughout the whole game. It's got to be Velvet. There's no other. There's no other way, man. It's gotta be. I mean, Rue gave us the ding anyway, so. <laughs> that tells us everything we need to know. Now, Velvet, what all did I get for you? I mean, I got everyone fairly decked out and stuff. It didn't even take all that long, actually. It only took a couple hours to do, to do everyone's grinding.、Um, if even a couple hours, but. ベルベットではないかお前までも最後の時に糸葉を告げに来るというわけか血縁には定めすら及ばぬようじゃお願いですもうおやめくださいお母様も望まれてはいません愛する娘の裏切りの果実がお前たちだ。世を奈落へ追い込んだ原因がお前たちだ。その口が言うか。I mean, that's not her fault, dude. 私だけを憎めばいいのです。この命をお取りください。どうして世界を疎まれるのです。下がれ。おじい様。首を絞めてもう一度あの恐ろしい罪を味わえというのかお前は娘に似すぎているのじゃよう見るなこれ以上狂わせるな<笑> OK <笑> At least he admits it I guess みんな共に連れて行くぞ終焉へ To the end of the world, huh? I feel like the end of the world is going to be real soon if we don't 
fucking stop you, dude. Not the music I expected. I was a little taken aback by it. It's too late, honey. So many other people were dead already. I mean, yeah, but bruh. Okay. Uh, let's see. What all did I get for you? We got a napalm painkiller. So many elixirs. <laughs> a single shine potion that we just happened to have. And then, ah, that's right. I got you an ancient crystal too. So let's use the ancient crystal first. Uh, wherever it is. Oh, it's already equipped. Um, close the cauldron's eye to stop the Armageddon. Okay. Uh, let's set that back. Okay. And then, do we have any ice or anything like that? Ice or fire? Now we got some napalm. Shine. We got a single blizzard. I mean, do we just use the blizzard? I, I guess they're not even on the screen right now. That'd probably be dumb. Okay. Uh, so we'll start it off with you and with... Okay, well, that's not annoying or anything. And a painkiller is what I was trying to do. Hey, thank you for knocking that over here for me. How do we... How... Okay. So it said to close the eye. How do we... How do we close the eye? Ow, dude. Okay. Uh, we're, we're so fucked already. This is going well. I'm very confused on what to do here. I'm not going to lie. Um, we need an elixir, please, quickly. Thank you, game. So do we... What do we attack? Do we attack those things that, that keep popping up? Oh, can we climb it? Ow. Okay, it's not particularly clear what you can and can't climb on, but you can seem to climb it. Okay, we're taking damage quick, though, so another elixir. I mean, being on fire is probably not helping, but oh well. <laughs> uh, we could just go invisible and then throw a bunch of napalm. Would that work? Does napalm work up here? Let's do foes on burst. Let's do overload. You have no idea? Me neither. Is it healing when it's absorbing this shit? I could have swore we used an unlimited potion. Maybe it uh, ran out already or something. Or maybe I didn't actually get to drink it because it got knocked out of my hands. I guess that's a possibility too. Uh, okay, so I'm assuming now we need to get back up somehow. Maybe? Ow. <laughs> Can we get back up? Okay, yeah. The only thing I'm not liking about this so far is it's really freaking hard to tell what you can stand on and can't stand on, dude. <laughs> this is a dodgy dodge situation? Ah, we're fine. Everything's fine. Oh, your Wi-Fi's acting up? Dude, I'm sorry. That sucks. This seems like a perfect time for a Fozon burst. And then, because I want to know, does it work with a... Or does a napalm work? Uh, technically, yes. It definitely did some damage. So we might as well use... Oh, well. Holy hell, we're about to die. Did our painkiller wear off? I think our painkiller wore off. So let's quickly heal. And actually, you know what? Use the blizzard, too. I don't know if it'll do anything, but it might do a little bit of damage. Oh, nope. There we go. Uh, da, 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 elixir. Seems to be stable now, but let's hope it stays stable. Ah, uh, no. Foes on burst. Get fucked. Um, <laughs> you demand it stays stable? Same, dude. Can we attack any part of you now? Oh, we need to take a painkiller before I forget. Okay, you're getting back up. Can I climb again? Uh, I can't climb on that. There we go. It seems a bit arbitrary when you can and can't climb. Oh, also, we're already out of freaking our unlimited power again, which that sucks, but... Hold on. Can I possibly maybe get a napalm down without it getting thrown out of my hand? Yes, let's go.
Get fucked, giant robot, bro. I think we got this. The only the only downside, the only thing I wish I would have done, I guess, is what I'm trying to say, is collect more, uh, more whatchamacallit, unlimited power potions, because those, those seems like that uh, really would have came in handy here. But I mean, we still we still haven't even used the ancient crystal yet. So even if we run out of everything, we still got one death before we actually die. Die. Wait for this shit to come back and continue. I wish we could do a foes on burst right now. That would be awesome. Oh wait, no, stay down. Why do you want to stay down? Is it possible? Because, like, I couldn't find a way... I, I'm, it probably is possible, but I couldn't find a way to, to damage him from from down bottom. There's some kind of plug down there. Plug. Plug. Oh. Okay. Oh, no, wait. Oh, right there? Oh! Dude, okay. That's a that's a nice hint. Is it taking Oh, okay. So that's just that's just another way to do damage. You don't necessarily have to do damage to them that way, but it's another way that you can. I got it. Kind of like it's heart. Okay. Okay, okay. Uh we still have another napalm. I'm just going to drink a painkiller real quick too before we take too much damage. And go back to kicking his ass, dude. Ow, bruh. I am so glad we got that painkiller because this dude outputs some damage, man. Like, holy hell. I did not mean to jump all the way down. It's fine. We still have a bunch of elixir. It's only been 32 minutes. And that was with, uh, including the 10-minute the startup, man. With the, you know, the, the pre-roll ad and the uh, waiting for everyone to get here and all that sort of stuff. We are doing well, I think. Hey, Chocobo, what's up, man? Just in time to see this dude get his ass kicked, hopefully. <laughs> uh, everything's suddenly very bright. I lost my equipment? Uh, or did I die? Did I die? Did that? <laughs> I mean, I'm still here, obviously. But did that kill me? What the hell? That did so much damage out of nowhere, man. Uh, okay, well, we still got a painkiller. Or a bunch of painkiller. Let's drink another elixir. No ancient crystal? Yeah. I thought I thought maybe whatever he did, like, broke our equipment. But no, I guess that just killed us. So whenever the, the screen starts to glow, that's our cue to GTFO. That's, uh... <laughs> that's what I got from that, man. All right. Wait, is he doing it again? No. Okay. Uh, but give me another elixir. Holy fuck, dude. This guy outputs some damage. I'm... Okay, wait. He's doing it again? No, he's not. Okay, level two flame, though. I kind of need to get off fire. <laughs> I don't know where he's getting all these Fozons from, but I could use some of them. Okay, let's uh let's heal before he does do something that actually hurts us. <laughs> oh, okay, so we're gonna we're gonna fall. And we're looking for the plug that's gonna pop out. We just wanna beat the shit out of it. Before that happens, painkiller. I didn't expect to take so much damage during this fight, I'm not gonna lie, man. This dude's got some wicked damage output. Okay, refill. And that's going back up in anyways. So let's try and uh, not die. <laughs> Hello? Man, you forgot how tanky this thing is? Yeah, dude. Why can't I climb? Game. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh, my God. Just, just get up, please. Oh, my God. We're about to die again. 
Oh my god, we are so close. We're dead. Oh, man. That was... This one's surprisingly tougher than I thought. Like, I mean, we still got this. I'm not worried about it. It's not like we need to uh, regrind or anything like that. But that thing outputs some damage, dude. A lot of damage really quick. So we got to we gotta be careful. And uh, now that we know what we're doing, at least, too, we'll be able to make better use of our unlimited potion and things like that. Instead of just running around trying to figure out what the hell we're doing, we'll be able to actually get to the top and hopefully pound this dude into the ground, man. Decommission this stupid ass cauldron. Uh, oh yeah. See, we only got to use like one unlimited potion during that whole thing, so that should help a lot. Oh shit! I just drank multiple times. I another thing that I learned <laughs> while I was grinding is that if you have a, a potion and you want to use it multiple times or whatever, you totally can. Um, you just have to keep mashing X. You don't have to go into the menu every time. Problem is, I was just mashing X there, not thinking about it. And so, you know, I just freaking used most of my unlimited potion. <laughs> my unlimited power potion. So, GG me. We ending there or starting a new one? Well, we don't know what game we're going to play next. So, we won't be able to start the next game. Uh, but what I was thinking of maybe doing is trying to see like what the bad ending is if 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 we get to keep our equipment and stuff um i don't know if we if we do oh my god dude i have i can't get up i'm gonna die here because i can't freaking get up on this dude <laughs> okay hold on quickly boson burst that should get rid hopefully of all his freaking arms okay besides one apparently elixir Okay, there we go. Now, beat the hell out of this dude, please. Uh, did my, my unlimited potion must have wore off already. Uh, stay away from the cauldron, okay. That's the thing we don't want to get hit by. That's the thing that... Oh. Okay, so you, you gotta be really far away from that. Noted. We'll keep that in mind for next time. Playing one of the bad ends. Yeah, that's that's the plan. Probably going to try and play one of the bad endings. As long as we think we got time for it. Obviously, it'll depend how quickly we, we make it through here and whatnot. And if I can get up on this dude. Just go to sleep. <laughs> okay. He's going to fall. I'm going to put out the fire, drink a painkiller, drink an unlimited power potion if we have any left. I think we still have one. Take an elixir, too. I didn't drink all of the U, did I? I think I... Oh, shit. I must have drank all of it. Oh, my God. I can't believe I fucked that up like that, man. I'm so mad at myself. I was just mashing X trying to hurry up and get back into it, and instead I, I drank all of the potion. Oh wait, his little his little battery thing hasn't come out yet. Oh my lord, it outputs so much damage, man. Even with the uh, the painkiller, I'm really glad we collected all that painkiller, or otherwise we would be completely fucked here. Okay, elixir. And back to beating him. I should probably, you know, put the fire out that's on me, but I, the fire doesn't do that much damage. It looks like we can we can steal some of the Fozons from him as they're coming in. That's kind of neat. Okay, I'm, he's going to fall again. Now, this time, the thing will come out, right? Since he actually, like, fell, fell? Maybe? Maybe not. No, not yet, I guess. Okay. Oh, wait, no, it is down there. It is down there. Oh, 
Oh my god, you suck. <laughs> Let me up, please. Okay, you know what? Actually, just get the hell away from him for a second. Let's take our painkiller. Oh. We have quite a few left. We're okay. Also, we should... I wasn't paying attention. Since we lost our, our, our ancient crystal again, we should equip that as well. Oh my god, dude. The damage output on this guy is insane. Elixir. Oh my lord. It'd also be a lot easier to get up there if we weren't, you know... <laughs> If we were able to jump just a little bit higher. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you got things that hurt. I know. Oh, God. Oh, we're still alive. Another Fozon burst. Or oh, that was a Fozon release, you dumbass. <laughs> That's not what we wanted to do at all. If anything, we just powered him up. <laughs> oh. Okay, quickly do a heal. We're in level 3 fire now. I mean, it still doesn't seem to be doing that much damage, honestly. Okay, is he going down? He's going down. Come out, come out wherever you are, battery. Come out his butthole already. <laughs> Need that butthole to prolapse so we can beat the shit out of it. <laughs> God, that's nasty. I'm sorry. Ow. It makes sense, but it's annoying that his foot just happens to fall, like, directly where we need to stand to... to do damage to, to the battery. Oh, God. Come on, break some of the thingies, please. These thingies, they hurt when they hit. Uh, Blizzard? I don't think the Blizzard actually is going to do anything, but, like, why are you like this? I can't help it, man. <laughs> I know, I'm sorry. Uh, where's the elixir? There it is. Uh, that's a no for me, sir. Oh, shit, we're out of power. Uh, regain power quickly, please. The blizzard, I think, is blowing away his uh, eye beam fire thingy, so that's nice. Oh, we got frozen. How did we get frozen? Isn't it my blizzard? <laughs> or does he have like different elements that he can that he can make use of? Are they not always fire? All right, got to regain power. There we go. And beat him. GG, he's down again. Jump off. Do we need to do anything? We still have a painkiller, but I'm going to re-up it anyways. It's not like we don't have extra. I wonder... I wonder if a uh, napalm would do anything to his battery. Okay, wait for it to start opening up. There it is. Wait, did the battery actually come out that time? Oh, there it is. It's just now coming out. So we can use the napalm as kind of like a range thing. Oh, I think my own napalm. Dude, the napalm is the way to go on the battery. Holy hell. Hold on. Quickly, quickly now, game. Uh, Get another one. That might be enough to GG. Ah, oh, he already put it away. Okay. Well, next time, we know what to do. All we got to do is napalm the shit out of his battery, and he's dead. <laughs> like, that did so much damage so quick. I know why Valkyrie was constantly talking about napalm, man. <laughs> like, shit's OP. Napalm is 42. Come on. Go up. Oh my god. It's fine. Let's get down. Let's get down. Uh, We don't have any of that. Heal. 
We still have Painkiller on us. It's insane. Like, Painkiller makes us take, what, like, half damage or whatever? How much damage he's outputting even though we have that? Like, we, we're dead. We're fucking dead again. How? Oh, my God. It's fine, though. We know, we know how to beat him. We got this. We got the strat now. We just got to napalm the shit out of his, his little battery thing. Ugh. I just still find it hard to believe how much damage we take, even with Painkiller, you know? Fucking oof. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Fucking oof is right. Ugh. Okay. Two things we can do. One... Don't drink all three unlimited potions as soon as we get into the game. That, that'll that be a huge help. Uh, and two, we can do the napalm thing that we now know about. Uh, he's going to hit us. Yeah. Get away. Not napalm, painkiller. All right. I'll get the hell up there. Oh, and then here we still have our foes on burst, so that should that should make pretty quick work of uh, most of his little dangly things, his arms. <laughs> Come on, boy, let's go! Beat the shit out of him! Don't stop! Okay, he's down for a moment. We should probably take this chance to, to heal ourselves. And then... If it's anything like last time, though, he won't drop the battery just yet. We have to get him down two or three times before that happens, so we might as well just go straight back up. Is it like... So... I wonder if he does more damage the farther in we get because like he's absorbing more foes on so he's getting hotter all right the cauldron's heating up so like the steam vents and shit are, are are hurting more i don't i don't know if it's anything like that but that's what it makes me think at least that's the that's the vibe it's given off okay i don't think he's gonna drop the battery yet i think it'll be the next drop but we'll we'll hang around for a moment and see No battery? Ah, oh, battery! There it is. Okay. Fucking napalm, dude. Let's go. Where's it at? I'm I'm blind as shit. Where's the napalm? Oh my god, it's so good. Okay. Napalm? <laughs> dude, that is just ridiculous. Okay, we're gonna save the next one for the next cycle. Um because, again, it seems like he gets harder the, the farther into the fight you get. So instead of just using all three right there, we're going to we're gonna save the last one for the end. Also, lag, yeah. There is a bit of lag. It's not too bad, though. It's, it's nothing like uh, when we're fighting what's-her-name in the, the underworld. That's some freaking lag, dude. Oh, shit. We did it! We actually lived! <laughs> Go us, man! We're not complete idiots! Uh, ow. Yep, we're out of painkiller, so drink another one of those real quick. And... Ow, again. You know what? Boson burst into... A... Not that. Into an elixir. I don't want to die. We're so close. Again. Elixir into while he's not doing anything, might as well use another use of you. Oh, come on, dude. <laughs> the answer to everything. Glorious, glorious napalm. <laughs> <That's>, <laughs> sounds a bit twisted, I'm not gonna lie, but uh, I see where you're coming from, dude. That shit is OP as hell when used correctly. This might be it. Come on, drop your battery. Wait for it to get out. And toss. Napalm, where is it? There it is. Let's go. Please, please. 
Let's freaking go, dude. <laughs> Hell yeah. Death to the Cauldron is right. We got that. There we go, man. Ah, uh, awesome. Whew. All right. One more to go, man. It's amazing what being prepared does. いや、ディ、フォーリオ。邪魔しよっていうさんぞ、この。どうしてよの前に出てくる、あれと同じ姿で。Is he actually going to do something good? さあ、出てこい、レヴァンタン。目覚めの時は来た。その揺りかごから急いで入り出せ。Wait, what? <laughs> uh, what just happened? Okay, then. Save your game. Yes, please. Meet Levinth and the World Eater. Oh, good. Good. I was, I was wondering when they'd show up. Fuck me, dude. Um, What was I going to say? Oh, it's been an hour. So you know what that means. We got to take our quick break, guys. Perfect timing, I guess. Suspense is real. We're going to go into the final battle in just a few minutes. Finally wrapping up Odin's Fear. And then maybe we'll try and do the bad ending or something like that. We'll figure that out whenever we get there. But we'll be right back in just a few minutes, guys. Perfect time to get a drink. Uh, I almost said a shower. Uh, don't. I mean, you can if that's what you need to do. But I don't think you're going to have enough time. Drink, snack, stretch, that stuff. That's what I was trying to say. <laughs> BRB. <laughs> Also, yeah, that's right. We gotta we gotta finish three in first three times, right? So we gotta win three times to get the prize. I guess that's one way to make the game last longer. Just make people do the same thing multiple times in a row. I'm being too hard. It is it is a kids game after all. Like <laughs> like so far for a kids game, it's pretty decent, you know. Although like it seems to require a little bit of reading. Which for like small, small children might be an issue. What age do kids start learning to read? Like, I don't know. <laughs> I haven't been a kid in a long time. I don't really remember what age I learned to uh, learn to read at this point, you know? But yeah, tell me more about uh, Craftopia there, Nate, if you don't mind, man. I am curious about it. I do like survival crafting games. Like I said, I've been playing uh, some Seven Days to Die. With, uh, you know, just with my brother and whatnot. And a friend of ours. And uh, it's been pretty fun. Seven Days to Die, for anybody who doesn't know, is essentially like... I'm, it's like basically Minecraft. <laughs> like, there's mining, there's crafting, you build a base. And then roughly every seven days... Roughly every seven days, there's a uh, horde of zombies that come to kill you instead of just a, uh, like, the random ones that are out and about. 
And then you like you get missions that you can do like treasure hunts that you can dig for treasure and whatnot and then there's like missions to collect supplies that have been hidden in different areas uh like different houses or waypoints or whatever missions to meet other traders to to clear out an area whatever the case may be and uh when you do that you get experience as well as loot of course that you can use and then you can you know with experience make yourself a better crafter unlock new recipes all that kind of good stuff so it's actually it's pretty fun it's not bad man i uh i'm pretty sure i got it on like humble bundle at some point or something so i don't really remember how much money i paid for it but like it's fun and it's got a uh, you can host private servers you can rent servers you can make public servers uh you can play peer to peer and all that stuff so like it's a lot of fun there's a big modding scene for it, too, it looks like, which is pretty cool. Like, uh, the one mod I would definitely suggest for anybody that decides to try out Seven Days to Die is uh, the one for the UI. Because the UI is the one thing that, like, kind of sucks in Seven Days to Die, I'm not going to lie. For a game that's been being worked on for, I think, ten years is what my brother was telling me, it's a little rough around the edges, man. It's missing some polish, like, similar to Minecraft. You're still somewhat early game. You're kind of chilling on the first island and upgrading to the next stage as much as I can. I have to look it up or something, man. So, like, similar to Minecraft, but you're saying, like, there's... Oh, when you win the stuff, you get big batteries. Okay. Uh, Who do we want to play as, man? I kind of want to play as Chucky. I like Chucky. Anyways, uh... But, yeah, like, you mentioned progressing to the next stage. Does that mean... Like, you have to do research, or is it just, like, as you level up, or how does, like, the, the ages and shit work in it? I'm always looking for new games to play, so, like... <laughs> Not that I have time to play any games, really, but, like, shit, still. That's nice. I'm glad that it has the... It's... All right, guys, we are back. Let's get into it, shall we? Everyone ready? I hope so. So I'm fucking ready. I love how it still has the character select screen, even though there's only one character left that we could possibly play as. <laughs> like, <laughs> knock down the crown, knock down the crown. So I'm guessing we're going to be knocking the crown off of the, the dragon then, right? Like, that's got to be the connection there for the whole thing. Let's go. Let's go, dude. Let's <laughs> This is that little dragon? Yeah. Not so little anymore, man. Putting out a volcano with a bucket of water. I mean, it could be possible. <laughs> Holy hell, dude. That dude got huge, man. What the hell? For anyone who doesn't know, the first time we met this thing, it was literally just like a little tiny baby. Just, just hatched. Mountain gone, Brahma mirrors are gone. Yeah. Oh, hey, there's a piece of a shell. It's a neat little uh, callback to when he was a baby, having not only the crown on his on his horn, but also the the little piece of shell, of course. 
What's with the the calming music? This is <laughs> this is not battle music. What is this? Okay. Uh, so we got an ancient crystal for her as well. We'll take that. Oh, that's right. I wasn't able to make elixirs with her, but we have a bunch of healing potions, so I'm hoping that'll be okay. Um, so we have some ice spirits. We have some regen. So this one might actually be hard. I don't know how hard this fight is, but this one might be a bit of a pain. I remember now because her beginning didn't have much that we could do in the way of like painkiller and, and stuff. Uh, but hopefully that's fine. Let's go ahead and drink a painkiller. Oh, okay. <laughs> we, he summons lightning. Well, either that or I guess maybe the lightning just came of its own accord. Oh, wait. Is it a climbing thing again? Oh, we're climbing again. Okay. Okay. You forgot to tell me. Wait, watch out for the weather. Yeah. Ow. It's fine. We're fine. Everything's fine. <laughs> this makes me think of the... This makes me think of a... Oh, God. Of Dragon Ball Z, man. When he's when he's running down the... The whatchamacallit? Whenever he dies, that's what this is making me think of. Okay, so we need we need some heals already. That's that's good. This is going well. Just drink it. Just drink it all, honestly. <laughs> Maybe go ahead and throw down a regen while we're in here. I still don't understand why we have like the, the soothing music from the beginning of the game in here. That <laughs> feels awfully weird. <laughs> is there a better way to get up to the crown, or do we really just have to slowly climb to the top. I'm I'm open for any hints that I need to know to make this uh this fight go better slash faster or whatever. Of course we have plenty of time. If we end up needing to do some more grinding, I guess we could. Um can I will that reach? It did. No not Cyclone. I mean Cyclone's fine, I guess, but that's not really what I just wanted to do. <laughs> oh, nope. I'm trying to get to the top, please. Uh, is there a way to dodge these? <laughs> I don't think there is. <laughs> the music is so... Oh, we actually made it to the top. Dope. Okay. So just, just fucking do everything, dude. Uh, back up just a tiny bit. And napalm. We have some napalm, don't we? It's weird how close to the edge of the screen everything is. It's fine. Napalm. Uh, that didn't do as much as I had hoped. But it did something, so we'll take it. Wait, can she actually... For a second there, it felt like we were actually flying. Uh, will Toxin do anything? It does. What else do I have? Killer Cloud? Yep. Okay, I don't think that did much, but you know what? Fuck it. Is that is that it for our throwables? I think that's it for our throwables. We have more Toxic Cloud or whatever, but that's that's pretty much it. Uh, bad part is I don't think I can get in the middle of that Toxic Cloud, or it'll probably hurt me too. <laughs> oh, ow. GG. Okay, this one actually doesn't seem that bad. I hope I don't jinx myself by saying that, but I think we're going to be okay. Climb, climb, and climb again. Oh, you know what else we should do, actually? Um, we should use the, the one ice potion that we have. Or ice spirits, whatever. That'll help a little bit. Is it worth attacking him whenever... Ow. Oh, oh, the spines on his fucking back hurt like hell. Is it worth attacking him, though, when he's down here like this? Or should I just focus on the climbing? It's annoying, but not too difficult. Yeah. 
honestly, it's not that annoying. It's not. I'm not nearly anno as annoyed right now as I was fighting uh, Onyx when I didn't know what the hell to do, you know? Once we had a strategy and, and some stuff to deal with him, he wasn't really bad, but getting to that point was a pain in the ass. The only downside right now is that I don't have any elixir, so we're bleeding through our healing potions pretty quick. Where's my other ice spirit? You can't keep climbing while he's attacking. The spikes stop you. Yeah, I kind of figured that out whenever it started, you know, <laughs> dealing a lot of damage to my face. <laughs> now, at some point, he tries to, like, eat us, right? So I should probably try and avoid his mouth. <laughs> yeah, okay. Good, good, good. I don't know what just happened, but he didn't seem to like it. If he doesn't like it, then I'm assuming it's good. Alright. Back to the climb, man. Oh, God. More thingies. Thingies out the ass. Let me get to the top. Let me get to the top. Oh, God. Fuck you. Again? Oh, my God. <laughs> All the way back to the bottom. I used to like her little dive attack, but now that little dive attack is kind of annoying, man. <laughs> Making us fall all the way back to the bottom like that. How dare it. Ow. Ow. <laughs> well, that didn't feel nice. Uh, We still have the painkiller going. Drink some more health tonic. One swig. Well, okay, we're taking two because, yeah... Oh boy, back to step one. Yep. Back to step one. But honestly, like, it I don't know. It doesn't seem too bad. We can still do damage to him whenever he looks down. So even if we don't make it clear to the top again, at least we can, you know, still damage him a little bit every now and then. Ow, son of a bitch. I would like to know how getting struck by lightning makes me fall all the way back down to the bottom. <laughs> Uh, you know what? We should probably go ahead and drink some health potions, too. Oh, he's back. And we missed. Sudden stops the magic stop you from flying. Need to regain power. There we go. Uh, what do the red eyes mean? That means he's gonna eat us. <laughs> That's what that means. Uh, excuse me, game? <laughs> I don't want to be here. <laughs> oh, because it's canon that humans are just... Or Valkyries are just human wearing special armor. Good to know. Oh, no! My magic potion! <laughs> Bro! <laughs> That wasn't very nice. You can't just knock that out of my hands like that. Up and up and up we go. Okay, painkiller just wore out. Drink another one. We got him like three quarters of the way there. Just please. Oh, that was close. We made it to the top once. We can do it again. Ow. Ah, oh, god damn it. I wish whenever he was down here like this, we could just freaking jump on his on his actual back. Bad levy, bad dragon. Ah, <laughs> oh, damn it, he ate us again. Yep. And oh not clear to the bottom. It's okay. We're fine. <laughs> Everything is fine. Ch chug an entire entire bottle of potion. Ow. Oh, man, I didn't. I thought we were clear from that. Come on. Ah, oh, no, stop it. I don't think we have anything that we can use against him here. No, we don't. Oh, we're out of healing potion? Uh... This is much worse than I expected. <laughs> no, don't go to the bottom! 
<laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh god. Why why are you saying I'm not trying to dive. I'm just trying to attack. <laughs> okay. It's fine. We still have the ancient crystal. That'll bring us back with like half health. Whenever we inevitably die here in a moment. Focusing. So are you saying that it's that much better to get to the top than it is to... Like, falling is so bad that it's better to just wait and get to the top than it is to attack? Because if that's the strat, that's what we'll do whenever we uh, inevitably, you know, completely die here in a moment. In your opinion, yes. I mean, it's definitely easier to do damage from here, that's for sure. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, let's go, dude. <laughs> So fucking close. And technically we died, but the thing he saved us, we got him, dude. Hell yeah. Oh, we broke off his horn. <laughs> oh, I don't think we could have made that closer if we tried, man. That was good. So that's it. Ending cutscene. True ending cutscene, yeah, yeah. Is her dad gonna save her? She lies? Nope. Hubby does. Makes sense. Save your game. Yep. So the one problem with doing uh, the bad endings now is that uh, I'm fairly certain all the stuff that we used is going to be gone. So that means we would have to do another grind session, which would eat up probably all of the time that we have. So I don't know. I don't know what to do, man. You have no idea. I mean, we'll check and see, but I'm pretty sure it's going to... It's gonna use up all of the shit that we uh used.
なあにちょっと行ってみただけじゃない本の飾りをちぎっちゃった後でパパに行って直してもらわないとアリスちゃんこれがエミロの幼の降りてらっしゃいケーキがあげたわよわあケーキだって<笑>はい今行くわママ<笑>来ないのソクラテスもういいわ置いていっちゃうよはい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。生きてる君が落ちるのを見た時は初めて天に救いを願ったよ力の使いすぎか<笑>あれは魔法の大釜まだ残っていたのかコルネリウス様大丈夫だコルドロンは炉を壊さないようにと思いましたが世界中から吸い尽くしたフォゾンの結晶は使い切られていましたこれではイングベイの言う救いなど敵か味方か<笑>グエノリ生きているわ二人とも息があるこれはティトレルの指輪どうしてこの子が運命なの指輪が巡って今この手に、right、where need to be, man. でも炉に力など残されてはいないというのに<笑>黒い先生私の役割がようやく分かりましたまだあった決勝はここにありますこのサイファーに刃は決勝からできている元の決勝に戻せば炉に力を与えることができるダメだベルベットコルドロンを操れば君まで呪われてしまうコルネリアス様おそらく全てはこの時のためにあったのですこの二人が冠なき二人の王人類の始祖となる父と母なのですそして指輪がはまった私の手が女自身にある救いを見てベルベット大地が崩れる急がないと今魔法の力を逆転せしめ。ボスはインサスを受けて委ねる。その命の源。ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ
I mean, you got the same thing with Adam and Eve and all of that too, right? That's just common creation myth. Oh, and then after the Great Flood as well. Right, with only the one family living. Oh, she was cursed to become a puka, so that was her and Corny Boy together at last, dude. That's nice. どこまで行っても大地はこの有様だ。死の国よりもひどい。生き残ったのは私たちだけなのですか。わからない。だがこれほどの大災害で生きている方が奇跡だ。おそらくは。ともかく落ち着ける場所を探そう。yeah the, what happened with the coins and then like so they weren't the only two to live because like we saw valent uh velvet and 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 corny boy so i mean they were puka not human at the time but they still lived, right? There's another scene, the kind of secret ending. Well, I mean, we're gonna we're gonna wait it out, obviously. One because the devs, you know, deserve their 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 15 seconds of fame or whatever. <laughs> but also, the music's just really good, so fuck it. And yeah, I want to know what the hell <laughs> what the hell happens, man. <laughs> You can skip this because it is just text. You don't know if we get to it though. I have no idea. I'm worried to skip anything and and you know end up missing anything. Besides, like I said, the the devs do deserve their their you know 20 seconds of fame, 15 seconds, whatever the hell the saying is. I really hope he got it. It takes a lot to get it. I don't know what part I'm supposed to get. So, grandpa. So I mean, Alice has to be if if so if this is all real you know not just just alice reading books fake tales or whatever um then alice would be related in some way to to them but i don't know i think you have to be all of the endings and collect the rest of oh you might be right actually because when i was reading um, about like the difference between the PS4 version and the PS2 version, they that they I think they said something about there being an extra thing if you see all of the endings, but I think in order to do that you have to beat the end of the game like four times or something. But never did the bad ending and you got it. Okay, I mean we'll see, we'll see. I hope you're right, Rue, but I, I'm not positive. We'll definitely find out. She's the she is their descendant, yes. So who would her grandpa be? I mean, I guess it would have to be Oswald then? But that's not a very long time in between the two things. If not, we can tell you what. I mean, yeah, yeah, for sure. If Let's wait and see if we get it. Um, and then if we don't get it, then yeah, you guys can tell it to us and or uh, after the stream. I'll probably look it up on YouTube too if it's there. Possibly it's never actually stated who her grandpa is. I'm assuming it's a longer line of descendants than that, but, like, I don't know.
He ran like out and got a lot of coins. You think centuries have passed? Yeah, no, I, I think you're probably right. It's just, I don't know, it seems weird that they would specifically say, you know, their, their grandpa, Alice would, if we never met the grandpa, but whatever. You think it said so in the secret ending? Okay, okay, okay. Said if we uh if we don't get the secret ending here, you guys can tell us what happens, and then I'm definitely looking it up on YouTube. Hopefully, it's available on YouTube. Really good game though, man. Honestly, I had a I had a ton of fun with it. It's got some uh, some rough edges every now and then. Um, I I imagine from what you guys have told me that a lot of that's fixed in the the PS4 remake. And uh, if we ever do come back to the game, that's definitely the version we'll be we'll be playing, cause yeah, <laughs> well worth playing on PS2 or otherwise. But uh, I do think the remake is the way to go. Yeah, way better. I mean, it's just the quality of life stuff for me, you know. Like having the uh, the the storage person, um, the the ability at the end if you want to see all of the endings to be able to just pick and choose. Which, which battles you want to do after you beat it the first time. Uh, oh, shit, I can't remember the other changes now. My mind is blanking, but you get the point. <laughs> the, oh, the lag being fixed. I mean, the slightly, you know, smoother graphics are nice or whatever, but... I, I mean, I'm sitting here playing a shit ton of PS2 games. I don't think graphics are the, uh, <laughs> the end of the world to me one way or another. As long as they're not absolute dog shit, like, yeah... The lag is definitely not a thing. I would hope so, man. <laughs> Taking a PS2 game and playing it on the PS4. Even with slightly updated graphics. Like, oh, the maps are way more interactive. That's nice. That's nice. I'm just gonna... I'm gonna look up the list real quick. Might as well while we're waiting for this. Oh, wait. Is it done? It might have ended. Oh, they released a semi-official picture with Alice's parents in the background. That's neat. Thank you for playing, Finn. Thank you, man. There's new moves, less clunky, more fluid combat. Special attacks have all been redone. Inventory system is reworked. Alchemy is reworked. Camera is more zoomed out and widescreen. Frame rate is basically locked to 60 with only a couple hiccups. Trophy support, new enemies and bosses, and areas and skills, and items and food. <laughs> uh, map and exploration throughout rooms is more like Metroidvania style. Graphics are 1080p. Oh, here we go. Hi. That's the world tree, by the way. ドラゴンがいなくなってからというものは、いい町になったものな、タイタニアは。変わった格好だね。どこから来たんだい。わからないって変な人だな。もっとちょっと気をつけろ。あんたも造成掘り出し物を見つけに来た口でしょ。ほら、図星だ。ナップラーを一つくださいな。よし。<笑> <laughs> I'm so confused, dude. Oh, 
レンタインの記念硬貨と交換しようじゃねえかここだけの話なんだがこれは願いが叶うっていう珍しいコインなんだよし決まったいいだろうん<笑> The secret bad ending ワルキューレだよオーダインオのお姫様に見えたなクワバラクワバラ西の方でまた戦争かねえあんたも行商するならあの辺はやめておきなよんはああんた物書きかねここのことを書くってそりゃいい Wait. 俺のこともしっかり書いてくれ Does that mean ああじゃあな We are grandpa? <laughs> Did we write the books that Alice is reading? ぜひその本を売ってくれああそうだせっかくだし聞いておこうかさあ、uh... なんて題名なんだい<laughs> I think I think we're grandpa <laughs> that's <laughs> and then Alice is reading our books that's that's the impression I got from there man why else would they why else would they ask are you writing a book and what's the title of your book and then you know the book is the gate that's the only way it makes sense in my head at all I have no idea if that's the case, but that's the only way it makes sense to me. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see what time. We got 20 minutes before the next break was supposed to happen. Uh, Valkyrie is pretty sure that if we load from here, we get to keep all the stuff that we had going into the gauntlet at the end. So let's, uh, let's load in and see, man. Because if we if we do, then we'll we'll do one or two of the bad endings, uh, assuming we have the time. Wheel of Fate. Oh, that's the that's a new book. That's right. They did drop a new book, didn't they? Press X to read. You gotta go. See you later. Oh man, sorry to see you go, Rue. Have a nice uh, whatever you're you're doing. I hope it's a good thing. <laughs> see you later. Read Wheel of Fate. Yes. What is what is this? Prelude Act 1, The Cauldron? Wait, what? Is there... Is there more? Oh, is this just the ending cutscene? Okay. Okay, 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 yeah. It's just the... It's just the ending. Got it. Wait. Chapter 1, Act 1. That is it, right? Like, is this just loading into the next... Okay, yeah. It's just loading into... To, to the uh, to the credits? Okay. Huh. So if you just want to watch the end again for some reason. Or I guess once you maybe unlock the secret ending, then you could go there and, and do, the, do that that way as well. Like, to, to get to the secret ending. Makes sense, I suppose. So we need to go to Armageddon. Now, is there a certain, like, order that we should do these in? I, I mean, the wrong order, obviously, but... <laughs> Read Armageddon. Yes, please. Not really? Okay. In that case, then I'm probably just going to do them in the order that they're listed. Like the the characters are listed. I'm curious how much of the game it's going to end up changing. But like, some bosses got extra scenes for some fighters. Oh, okay.
Oh, here we go. Perfect true ending requirement. In order to unlock the additional scene in the Wheel of Fate, you must not only achieve the true ending, but also unlock every single cutscene found in various versions of the Fall Sun. In the original PS2 version, getting the perfect true ending would require the player to play through the Armored Good and Book a minimum of four times, as some bosses have more unique Fall Sun ending cutscenes than others. Once the Armageddon book is started, the player cannot go back to one of the previous uh, Boston or blah, 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 blah. Yeah. Lame. Could be wrong, though. I think you have to unlock all the specials to get the secret ending. Uh, yeah, I mean, that's what it sounds like, or at least from what I just read there on whatever wiki page that was. Uh, you just have to get all of the cutscenes to to unlock the secret ending, which means that you have to redo the fights with all of the uh characters that get extra cutscenes, essentially. Well, by loading up Gwendolyn first, that'll tell us really quickly too if we get to keep all of our items or if we lose them all. Ingwe has two special scenes. YouTube time? <laughs> yep. <laughs> I kid. I mean, that's probably what I'm going to end up doing, honestly. Hell, I might even be able to bring it up on YouTube. Because, I mean, I'm definitely going to look it up for myself. If we don't do it on stream, I'm still looking it up for myself, because I want to know what the secret ending is. I mean, they told us what happens, but I still want to see it, you know? You miss what happened to Valentine at the end? She turned into a... Or Velvet, you mean? Velvet's the girl. Valentine is her, her lineage or whatever. Uh, but anyways, Velvet turned into a Puka. And... Whenever the little girl found the Puka coin in the book, Velvet and her boyfriend both appeared from a portal to collect it. So they survived somehow, um, but it's not really said how or how many of the Puka or anything. So, uh. What happened to tentacle face? Oh, 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 okay, I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, I don't think they said. Valentine threw himself into Le Leviathan's attack and died. Oh, is that what that was? Okay. I saw him throw himself into something, but I didn't realize that was him dying, you know? Uh, and yeah, no, we do get to keep all of our stuff that we have. So, I mean, we can try and get some of the other cutscenes at least. Might as well, since we're not, you know, starting the next series today. Uh, we should probably back up, take some painkiller and stuff, though, before we get wrecked. Oh, this is the dude that we gotta... Is this the one that we have to kill, like, three times? In order to actually kill him? The one that was super annoying? Like... <laughs> I mean, I shouldn't be surprised, you know. Bosses at the end of the game are going to be tanky. You thought he was going for a ride? Yeah, honestly, I thought he was, like, going into some magic thing to, to power up or something. I don't know. I didn't I didn't think he was uh, killing himself. Okay, uh, health potion. What else do we have, actually? We have Killer Cloud... Health potions. That's about it. Some napalm. Oh, we do have some ice. Let's take the ice spirits, too. Whatever. <laughs> Where, where's health? Health, please. Oh, goddamn. I didn't mean to drink all three. Such a waste. Uh, oh, this is the, the Toxic Cloud. We want to stay low for this part. I kind of remember. Uh, good job staying low, me. <laughs> hey, we want to stay low. Instantly jumps up into the air like a dumbass. 
Yep. Is he doing the toxic cloud again already? Oh no, ice. Okay. What time frame the the game is on? It's definitely years, man. Like I'm I'm convinced. I don't know that, you know, for sure. <laughs> I'm no lore expert for the game, but I'm pretty positive we're talking years at the very least. Just because like here, I don't know if I've ever shown it when you've been here. But this is the entire time frame for the game. Right? Like <laughs> from beginning to end goes all the way down to here, dude. It's a lot. <laughs> Honestly. So it starts with Velvet of the Lost Kingdom of Valentine's fixated on the brief moments of love she shared with Prince Cornelius. And then at some point Cornelius turns into a puka and like, oh my god, yeah. There, I, I have no idea how much time, but it had to be a ton. You caught the last bit of the game, you are just curious. Weeks, you think? Really? Only weeks? It feels so much longer. I mean, Valkyrie knows a lot more about the game than I do, so they're probably right, but... To me, it felt like the, the whole thing took place over the course of years, man. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a, that's a good point, too. He needed time to, uh, to grow up, get big and strong. <laughs> it's really difficult to tell. That's true. Yeah. The game definitely likes its uh, cryptic storytelling. He grew with magic. True, true, true. Can't argue with that. Definitely wasn't a, a natural birth. <laughs> the hyperbolic time chamber, yeah. <laughs> ah, damn it. Thankfully, I think we do actually have some antidote. Uh, somewhere in this mess of an inventory. Fuck you and your poison breath, dude. Ow. Cauldron absorbed the foes of the land so the continent was dying and the dragon grew in like an hour or something? Really? That quickly? Holy hell. Damn it, dude. Just die. Oh, painkiller ran out. Uh, take another one real quick. Please, game. Don't let me die now. It's so close. Just... Oh my god, just die, you bitch. <laughs> there we go. Thank goodness. You're dead, right? Yeah, you're not taking hits. You're dead. GG. So I guess we can probably tell who has unique cutscenes based off of the story menu. Hmm. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> I like that cutscene. <laughs> I wish that's what had happened in the uh, originally, man. In the in the true ending. You like this guy? So do I. At least right now, man. Screw him. He's kind of a dick, and you know, usually, but <laughs> but right then, in that moment, a plus guy. <laughs> oh. 
That makes me... Oh, man. See? Choose character fight Lord of the Netherworld. Okay. We're just going to... Like I said, we're just going to go down the list, I think. Lord of the Netherworld. That was... Oswald, originally. So, I just want to make sure that we don't use the right character at any point. So that we, we guarantee a different cutscene with uh, each person, at least, you know, one. Special scene. That's yeah, that's a good point, Valkyrie. So this is actually the super annoying fight, the one where we have to take him down like three times. I was thinking it was the other one, but no, it's this one because his heart comes out of his chest or whatever. Yeah. That's all right. We'll get him. I'm a little bit worried about the Onyx fight. On <laughs> hopefully, hopefully, whatever character we end up using with him will have uh, sufficient gear to, to deal with him easily enough. All right, Corny Boy. You have nothing. Okay. <laughs> You're... <laughs> Your fight must have been pretty easy. Uh, we can make a health potion, I think, with Cubs Bane, maybe? Oh, fuck. All right. Uh, it's fine. We'll, <laughs> we'll see what we can do. Uh, let's take the painkiller real quick. I mean, he is one of the stronger characters, thankfully, I feel like. So there is, there is that, at least. Do you have... Uh, okay, let's get the hell away from him real quick. Do you have ice or fire potion? You have an unlimited one. That's nice, but no ice or fire. Oh, God. Thankfully, the toast heals a lot. The praline also heals a fair bit. Okay. We're probably screwed, but <laughs> we're going to see what we can do. Ow. Ow. He also seems to have more uh, defense than a lot of the other people, too. Either that or the attacks of this guy are just really weak. But I don't remember them being weak, so... I think it's just that he has more uh, defense than a lot of the other ones do, which... Again, hopefully will will help. He's also one of the easier characters to control, I feel like. His, his moves are very... Uh, are very simple to understand to use. Oh god, I forgot about this part. This thing is annoying. Uh, okay, we want to stand in the middle. And then try not to be hit by... By that. <laughs> oh shit, we're also out of... We're out of potion. Uh, health potion. Just, just chug it all down real quick. You'll be fine. And then painkiller quickly. <laughs> Maybe get away from the maggots that are just falling on our face. Not the you. P. Do I have any P left? Did I only have one drink? I might have only had one drink. Yeah. I don't know how well this is gonna go. <laughs> we might be fucked after all. If it was just taking him down one time, I don't think it would be so bad. But taking him down three or four, whatever it was, I just, I don't know, man. I don't have, I don't have that much faith in myself <laughs> and my own ability to play this game. A better player than me could probably handle it. 
Let's eat that praline. Uh, praline, where are you? There it is. Oh, we get a couple bites on the praline. That that's handy, actually. Ow. Because without having any uh painkiller or anything, we're definitely gonna need it. Speaking of, let's take another bite now. Ow, dude! <laughs> so much damage without the painkiller. Oh my god. Thank goodness we're not dead. We're about to be, though, if we don't move. Can your head please go back into your body? Thank you. It's really hard to reach you when you're that high up. I forget who we use. We used what? Oswald. That's who we usually use to uh, to fight him. Oswald, I feel like, had a, uh, a better jump. <laughs> a better way to get up there and deal some damage. Never fight him without ice and fi fire spirits and napalm? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I, think, I think having those things would be a huge boon. But uh, sadly, we don't. <laughs> like I said, there's no way we have enough time to... Uh, to grind and come back to the fight. So we would spend most of the night just grinding to get napalm and shit. I forget that he can actually block. We do have, I think, what, one use of napalm? Maybe not. I thought we did. Nope, we just have a bunch of blank potions that we could do something with. Well, shit, dude. Oh, just fucking die, you bastard. Oh, my God. <laughs> so we can't, we can't hardly get up there to do any damage to it either. Uh, foes on burst. Uh... Yeah, it doesn't look like it'll let us do enough damage to, to kill him in one go. I'm pretty sure we're, we're forced to, to fight him at least two or three times. Well, damn, dude. That's too bad. I would have liked to see some of the uh, the alternate endings. And someday, someday I most likely will, whenever I get around to playing the, uh, the remake. If the foes on heal wasn't so damn slow... We could try and use that to, to get some heals in between. Oh, God. I forgot about that. Eat the toast. All the toast. <laughs> we definitely need the toast. Oh, we're so close to a full heal. What is that? I don't remember that being there last time. Ow. Getting on the head would probably be kind of nice, actually. Yeah, dude. Come on, come on, come on. Foes on burst. Oh, I shouldn't have done that, actually. I should have saved the foes on burst for the heart. Assuming we even make it back to the, to the heart section again. I don't think we're going to, though, to be honest. And yeah, there's no foes, foes on for us to absorb. One head down. Oh, nope, that's it. GG. <laughs> oh, well. Um, well, shit, guys. I didn't really have a plan on what to do, assuming we finished this early. I thought it was going to take a little bit longer. So, I guess we'll just call it an early Monday? Question mark? Uh, I will, right before we go, though, plug one more time the poll. If anyone hasn't voted on the poll but wants to have a say in the future of the channel, of what we play on the channel, go ahead and uh, vote on that. You can find it in the link tree that I will make up here in chat now. 
at the bottom of the link tree somewhere there should be a, a one called current poll you can go there and vote on up to three games i think right now the winners tied for first place are metal gear solid jack 2 and sly cooper the thievius raccoonus if we end up with a tie, a three-way tie, two-way tie, it doesn't really matter. If we end up with any kind of tie, we're just going to roll a die, flip a coin, whatever, you know, we need to do. And that's the one we're going to be playing. We'll be starting that up next Wednesday because starting this week, we are playing three hours a night of PS2 stuff for two nights instead of two hours for three nights. So we're getting the same amount of PS2 time in every week. Uh, and then we're adding one extra stream playing RimWorld. And starting next week, we are moving the Monday streams to Wednesday and going to be starting whatever the new game is. A lot of changes happening back to back with the schedule there. But yeah, just wanted to let everyone know what's going on there. And uh, I don't know. I guess thank you guys for coming and hanging out with me a little bit. Valkyrie, thank you so much for being here and all of your, your, your advice. It was a lot of, it was very, very useful advice. <laughs> very useful advice. Uh, without it, we probably would have been stuck on some parts of this game for much longer than we were otherwise. So thank you for that. Sim Games won. Yes, they did. Sim Games won the uh, the niche poll, uh, both with total count and also in that last poll, they they pulled it away by just uh, I think it was by one vote. So no matter which way you look at it, the Sim Games won. So we'll be doing RimWorld, uh, probably as the first one on on Friday. And then uh, after we play that for a little bit, whether, you know, our colony completely dies or we play something or uh, we get bored of it or whatever, whatever the case ends up being, uh, we'll move on to something else. and We'll decide what that other one is. Could be The Sims. I think that one would be kind of fun, honestly. Uh, Prison Architect would be another one that, that would be pretty fun, but also open to suggestions for things. Was uh, Oxygen Not Included is one that I've always wanted to play that looks really interesting. Anyways, point is, a lot of different choices there. Uh, but I just wanted to say thank you all. Thank you. And we'll see you in my head. What is today? Today's Monday. Tomorrow's Tuesday. See you guys tomorrow. <laughs> Bye-bye, guys. Have a wonderful afternoon. And as always, be kind to each other. Already beaten that level. What uh? What happens if we go to it again? 390 now?